Hey guys, this is the Piggy Gaming here with another video for you today. Today we are making a 3x3 three three piston door. So the first step that you want to do is to put two sticky pistons in the exact middle. Now make an L shape and put a lever, a redstone torch, a piece of redstone dust, and another piece. Put a building block right next to this powered redstone dust. Put a redstone torch, you will flick on and off, then put a right click a repeater three times. Now put a sticky piston here, a piece of your building block, another one, and then right put two cobblestone. Put a building block on top of this redstone torch next to the lever. Put another one. It will pulse quickly. Okay, now let's see how it works. Great. It will put the two cobblestone up, but only bring one of them down. This is where the next part comes in. So as you saw last time, it would only bring one block down. So this is our solution. Put a redstone repeater and right click it twice. Oak wood plank or whatever your building block is, another repeater, don't right click it, and a redstone dust. Through it. Put a sticky piston there, your building block, and a few more building blocks like so, and your final door block there. So now, put pieces of redstone like that, and put a redstone repeater right there. So let's test and see if it works. Extends them and retracts. So that's the bottom bit and the middle bit of the door. So now we have to put the rest of it. See where this redstone torch is? Put another one ne on top like that. Put another piece of your building block and put a redstone dust. Now put three sticky pistons on top of each other like this. Now build as I do like so. All three pistons will be powered once this is flicked on. Now put, now just fill in the frame pretty much and do the similar thing. Now you must put the three, just put three of your building block and put one down there, another one down here and one up here, like that. And put redstone dust. Now, for the top bit, put a piston there, facing downwards, and a redstone repeater, just to power the piston. And now, j finally, put these sticky pistons here, like so. And destroy those two. Now it should be fully functional. Closes and opens. Now that the 3x3 three three piston door is complete and fully functional, if you want, you can add a T flip flop. So the first thing you want to do is power this block by using a redstone repeater and placing redstone dust so that the redstone repeater will be powered. Place a few building blocks down like so like that and cover it with redstone dust. Now for the T flip flop bit. Where do you want to put your button? I just recommend it having it on the second out of three layers, like so. Then build it out towards about where the where the redstone dust is and place a button. I think I'll use stone for this. Now for the T flip flop bit. Just follow the same way I do it. Two building blocks, redstone on top of it, two powered redstone torches. Now, place the pistons. Sorry, we are nearly done. Just be a bit patient. Yeah, 
Yes, that's right. Now, when you click the button, works like that. And same thing. Hope you enjoyed. I hope this was helpful. If it was, leave a like, comment, and subscribe for more. Thanks for watching. This has been the Piggy Gaming, and I'll see you around. Thanks. Mm -hmm.